I'm going to show you how to add these viral wait lists directly to your Squarespace website in a matter of minutes. And as you can tell, I'm going to show you how this wait list works so you can get the whole view of the process. So I'm just signing up. I just put in my email. And once I'm in, I'm actually part of the wait list. So now I have a position in the wait list and I have invited zero friends yet. So now I can grab my uh, unique referral link or I can share it on Twitter, social media, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So let me show you how it works. So what we are gonna do is adding this button to your Squarespace page. And once you click that, it opens the sign up form. So the first step is going to Zootools. So you actually have the link on the description. It's the project that, that we run, zootools.co. And just sign up, follow instructions, super simple and fast. Now here we're gonna create a new waitlist test. And the goal in my case is gonna be, I wanna get more uses for a new product. Once the campaign is fully created, we will have access to this dashboard and we are just gonna go to the form. You will see a different sidebar just because this is kind of like what's coming up next, but just go to the sec section that says form. All right, so here there are a lot of things that we can actually customize. So I'm gonna choose different colors so that can match my brand. And I can change also the header. So I can pick one of these beautiful images from Unsplash, or I can actually upload a new image. In my case, I'm just gonna upload this one with the cats because uh, who doesn't love cats? <laughs> All right, so, and by the way, if you have any questions, you can just click on download this template and this is exactly the size and the measures and everything that you actually have to get. So once you're done with that, now we're just gonna change this color to match my brand. Uh, in this case, I'm going to use some, uh, something a little bit more advanced. I'm just going to copy the hex color using like some developer trickery. But normally, you know, if uh, in your company, you will probably know what is your hex color or you can actually ask your designer or anybody in the team that is in charge of that. So now that, ha that I have my hex color, I can exactly put the color that my brand has. In this case, since this, this is a little bit darky, I'm just gonna move a little bit up so we can show the white color over there. Awesome. I'm just gonna select light mode because I don't have a dark page, but you know, if that is your case, just go ahead with the, with the other configuration. I'm going to change the title. The email is fine. It's actually required. And I'm just gonna add one more question, which is the first name. And to be honest, I actually want to know what is your favorite food? Actually, you should put it on the comments, but what is your favorite food? <laughs> and here I can type pizza. I can say um, sushi, Spanish food, because I'm from Spain. So, oh my God, la, la tortilla española. Que rica que está. <laughs> okay, so... I actually like this design, but I think it's gonna be, since there are too many elements, I'm just gonna use the drop down, and, and that's pretty much it. All right. Oh, and by the way, if you wanna add multiple elements, you can actually click on that, and here you can add tortilla, uh, raw fish, whatever, and all these options are automatically added here. All right, awesome. So once I'm doing that, I'm just gonna publish changes, and you will see that there is this sidebar that open up, so we are just gonna go to the web tab because here we are just gonna grab all of these uh, configurations. So awesome, let's go back to Squarespace now. So I'm just gonna add, go to edit mode. I'm actually going to delete all of these so we can start from scratch and you can see the whole thing. So let me exit this one and I'm just gonna create a new page. So here on the Squarespace, I go to website I go to add a new page, or you can actually edit the existing one. And once you're there, I'm just gonna choose blank page. I'm just gonna call it waitlist form. And once here, let's just focus to edit this page in particular. So I'm just gonna add a new blank section. You can add any of these ones, but in, in our case, we're just gonna add a blank section, block, and here we can actually add a new embed. 
Nice. Let's click on edit. And here you see that there is link or code snippet. Let's click on code snippet, click on embed data, and that's it. So once we are here, what we are going to do is we are going to copy this first uh, script. We're just going to paste it there. And we're just going to copy the second script and we are going to paste it above. Nice. As you can see, this looks ugly, <laughs> but that's because we can customize a little bit more. So the first thing that I'm going to do, and by the way, if you're not familiarized with this, just follow these instructions and it's going to look beautiful. Uh, and if you have any questions, just uh, reach out to us on support at suetools.co. So the first thing that I'm going to do is adding some padding because I think padding looks good. For example, 30 pixels. And in the section that says border radius, we can set 10, 20, 30. So in my case, I, I just want to a little bit like more, more like 10, you know. And I'm just going to replace the receive updates by join waitlist. So you can type here whatever you want, actually. You just modify that. All right, awesome. So once we do that, honestly, we just added the widget directly into Squarespace. So that's huge. That's amazing. So let's actually exit. And now if we refresh the page, we can click on join waitlist now. And pa -pan, the waitlist is being loaded. So now if I click here and I say, for example, Jorge, Jorgito at sutrals.co, and I choose what's my favorite food. Honestly, I love all of them, not going to lie. But I'm just going to go with the Spanish food for now. Because uh, I miss my hometown. <laughs> so I just joined. And now you see that uh, my position is number one. So I'm the first one in the wait list. I have 30 points because I just joined. And I have invited zero people. Now, the really cool thing about this is that if I come over here and I copy my unique referral link and I open a new incognito tab. So I'm just going to pretend that I'm a different user, right? Like they're friends. If I do, now I'm Paco, Paco at suetools.co, and what is my favorite food? Let's say pizza. So Paco, do, 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 do. Paco is sign up, because here we are validating and verifying that Paco is legit, is a, is a good user, and should actually join and sign up. So once Paco is in, you will see that now Paco has zero friends because Paco has not invited anybody yet, even though here is the Paco unique link. But now if I close this and I go back here, you will see that automatically we show 40 points and one referral because Paco, oh, sorry, Jorge, this Jorgito, has invited Paco uh, and so far and so on. So you will see the whole process and how viral and cool the whole thing is. So this is pretty much it. Obviously, here you can customize and change this. So for example, one of the things that uh, we can do is, let's say here, let's say, let's say that I want to center the button. So you just add these labels, center. And since this is actually like a section, you can obviously add anything here as well. So you can, for example, say, get on the wait list right now. And you can actually say this is going to be, well, maybe not a heading, but like a heading three. So this is going to be more like that. Join the wait list. We are going to center this out, so we're just going to center that. And for example, we can actually move this up a little bit. And now we can also add a text, for example. So we can say here, get unique rewards by joining the list and inviting friends. Just click the button. I'm just going to minimize this, make it center, and that's it. So I've saved changes, I exit, and you will see that now, get on the way, this looks actually super cool, by the way, let me actually go back, this looks super, super cool. 
Get on the wait list right now. Get your rewards. Join wait list now. Bye bye. <laughs> so that's it. Hope you like it. If you have any questions, you can actually go directly to zootools.co. And on the section that says company, talk to sales, get support, just click there and you will find three different options to reach out to us. Send an email, send a message on your favorite messaging plats platforms or book a growth call, growth call. So yeah, hope this is helpful. Uh, and uh, we are super excited to see what you're actually building. So send me over and yeah, see you in the next video. Ciao.